Hello. The dinghy cradle needs to be replaced. The one that is there broke when we were making a passage across the gulf. We were in four foot seas. I believe the dinghy had shifted and uh, caused the uh, rear mount to uh, detach and uh, it basically bent up this bracket. Uh, the aft was lagged in and the front is uh, put in with a backing plate. That one obviously held. Still trying to figure out what my thoughts were about leaving the dinghy here while I was doing this. Guess I didn't want to put it down. But eventually I did. So on the uh, starboard side, we have a couple of screws that uh, needed a little persuasion here with a pair of vice grips. And they were stubborn. You even broke the heads off. But it's off. Should be able to pull them through the backing plate on the bottom. I'm going to drill out the existing holes with a, and make them larger and fill this with the uh, thickened epoxy. This is just in case the core got wet. Be starting dry. There's my uh, thickened epoxy. Put this in all the holes, and at some point in the future, we'll repaint this deck. But for now, I'm going to make it watertight. So here's my mock up. The bunks I purchased were uh, used on boat lifts. This is a 12-foot bunk. They cut it in half for me and made me two six-foot pieces. So I'm using a quarter-inch aluminum plate and quarter-inch aluminum L brackets to uh, build this and mount it to the deck. So just like before, the uh, the aft mounts are going to be uh, drilled through the deck and um, mounted with a backing plate. And again, I'm going to make larger holes and I'm going to refill them with uh, thickened epoxy. Hopefully, in the event that if uh, they don't get bedded properly, they uh, they will. Uh, at least not uh, allow water to get into the core. And once again, filling holes with thickened epoxy. Certainly made a lot of holes in the in the deck for this. So now for the final install. I'm going to use a uh, butyl tape to mount these uh, plates to the uh, to the deck. And I've bedded the, uh, the the plates with uh, screws, washers, backing plate, 
Nylox. I'm also treating the stainless steel hardware so that uh, we minimize any corrosion between the aluminum and stainless steel. product. Everything's mounted, bedded, in place. And now we can see it with the, uh, the boat in place. It's all strapped down underneath the uh, cover. The cover's strapped down. There's a view from the deck, dock. Thank you for watching.